Hello everyone, welcome to Home Again. If you find the video useful, please subscribe to the channel. So in this video, we'll solve this problem using the concepts of polynomial factoring. So as per the problem, in the given expression 38 times z to the power 18 plus b times z to the power 9 plus 30, b is a positive integer. If c times z to the power 9 plus d is a factor of the expression where c and d are positive integers, what is the greatest possible value of b? As per the problem, this expression is factorable. Let's start by writing the expression. In this expression, the first term has the exponent 18 on the variable z. The second term has the exponent 9 on z. This expression can be factored as a complex trinomial. The general equation of a complex trinomial is we can see in this general equation the first term has the exponent 2 on the variable x. The second term has just x in it. In the given expression, the exponent on z is double that of the exponent on the z in the second term. So we can treat the given expression as a complex trinomial. As per the problem, the factor of the given expression is c z to the power 9 plus d, where c and d are positive integers. That means we can factor the given expression using complex trinomial factoring method. We can use the decomposition method. As per this method, we have to find two numbers whose sum is b the coefficient of the middle term and product is 38 times 30 which is equal to 1140. So we have to find the greatest possible value of b from two numbers that multiply to 1140. So we have to find factors of 1140. The first pair of numbers that come to my mind that multiply to 1140 are 1 and 1140. The second pair of numbers that come to my mind that multiply to 1140 are 2 and 570. The third pair of numbers that come to my mind that multiply to 1140 are 3n380. Another pair of numbers that multiply to 1140 are 4n285. So there are many possible pairs that multiply to 1140. Now let's analyze the sum of these numbers which will be equal to b. If we add the numbers in the first pair 1 and 1140, we get a sum of 1141. The sum of the numbers in the second pair is 572. The sum of the numbers in the third pair is 383. The sum of the numbers in the fourth pair is 289. So we can see that the sum is decreasing as the first number in the pair is increasing. So as per this analysis, the greatest possible value of B is 1141. This should be the final answer for this problem. So these are the steps you have to keep in mind to solve a problem like this one. So I hope you'll find this video useful. Please share it, like it and subscribe to Homework Help. Thank you very much and have a nice day. Bye.